Welcome, this is the energy vibration for um, the second week of August 2017 um, and the week begins from the 7th until the 13th of August. For you Aquarians, it's going to be a water week with a zodiac energy of fire, so it's going to be uh, up and down, it's going to be, oh, I don't know, you know, a lot of things will be happening, but yet still, I want to thank you for returning. Thank you for a wonderful, positive week. It's going to be a week of emotional turmoil, but it's going to be okay. We all have to deal with these situations, so they will come. Sometimes you have good weeks, sometimes you have bad week, but it doesn't really matter because we're all here on a journey, okay? So... As we look at this week, the energy of love is here and it's wonderful. What I'm having at both sides of your reading, I wish if you could see that, um, you have uh, the threes, okay? So the three is like a, um, you're building something. Just look at your week like this. You're building something. You're trying to bring something you're trying to ground something in your life okay so you're trying to build something and you're trying to ground something in your life at the same time when we have the energy vibration of the number three it's always a positive one because it's always the mind body and soul that is trying to bring balance within you and this is this is really positive so it doesn't really matter what is happening around your life you are really trying to focus because you're focusing with a spiritual word but yet still grounding yourself and it's going to be a week like that because it's a week of water and fire so for you guys you really need balance and ground whatever else is going on it's going to be positive it's going to be movement new movement movement and positive movements that is coming up so if this week is going to be um, a week of you know just take it one day at a time whatever is happening take it one day at a time do not be worried about whatever is going on because it's going to be okay okay so you need to understand that this week is going to bring balance in your life on Monday what do we have on Monday we have the crown chakra what this is saying is that you need to connect with yourself and bring in the energy of information coming into you two four six eight ten so what is happening is that the energy of um, the your crown chakra is connecting with the international beam, the galactic beams, the cosmic beams, this sort of a thing. And they are going to um, bring you information that is going to help you. Whatever the information is going to be, is going to be money. So they are going to tell you and bring you a certain information that is going to help you. And with this, what is going to happen is that you are going to have a positive outset at how you look at money. And with that, they want to make sure that you understand what is the energy of these two. Connecting with the universal angels is one of the most positive things with whoever is your guides or whatever the crown chakra is very important so on Monday if you feel yourself losing energy call up on um, the energy vibration of Archangel um, Zachiel and Saint Germain if you don't work with angel call upon the um, purple ray to flow through you and surround you but whatever is going to happen the nine of Pentacles is here which is your foremost energy this is what this week is all about on Monday so Whatever it is is happening is as if you be getting some people will be getting ideas of what is going to happen, ideas of how you can make money, that sort of a thing, extra money, and it's going to work out for you. Okay, whatever is happening, the universe is sending you this information, and you need whatever the universe sends you this information. It means it sends you the information in love for you to use that information to um, bring positivity. Um, to yourself but also to others okay it is um, the information that is coming in is a positive information we have movement choices and decision movement choices and decision and this is always a two of Pentacles and it's another energy that I've seen coming up here 
and this is a good one because whatsoever is happening is that you have also the energy of uh, the queen of swords uh, movement so whatever is happening in your own energy vibration is there and you know the light and is bad the queen of swords so your energy vibration is there so whatever situation that is happening the choices and movement that is happening you are about to make choices and movement in your life and these choices and movement is actually coming through um, through the energies of uh, um, the universal angels and your spirit guides who are helping you to move yourself to a higher elevated um, and, and a vibrational situation which is extremely good so this is going to be good on you so whatever is happening there's going to be a lot of movement so a lot of changes that are going to happen a lot of movement a lot of situation that is going to happen and this is good as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the five the five of swords you're feeling trapped on Wednesday whatever the situation is is that you're feeling trapped on Wednesday and you need not to because um, you are being you know you're trying to just protect yourself whatever it is you're feeling trapped but um use this untrapped untrap yourself by protect yourself okay because when when we feel trapped is that we're putting ourselves in a lot of energies of really um you know creating these scenarios that is not really going to happen so release yourself of this in this week because it's going to be positive and i did this because we're working with um the energies and the universal energies are coming in and there are different messages that is coming in because after i've done a reading i can still see more messages and i have change up the way that I'm going to do the readings okay on Thursday whatsoever that is happening you're breaking that spell the energy of the tower comes so remember that this week is going to be a week of uh, um, emotional upsets this week is a week of emotional upset whatever is happening this week is a week of emotional upset be aware that you protect yourself whatever the situation is some people are going to have the energy of uh, the the king of cups who is going to come in and help out some people with their with this emotional upset this emotional situation that is going on so be positive be aware of whatever is happening and know whatever the situation is the tower is now broken down and whatever that was going on this uh, king of of cups is going to come in to help you to heal whatever the situation was or is okay so this is going to be positive this is going to be good as we move forward on Friday we have the energy of love and this is a wonderful situation because it's harmony so whatever that was going on on Thursday on Friday there is going to be harmony and victory 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 and success so whatever and whoever this person was and whatever they were trying to do and obviously this could be your own energy vibration that you created this situation it has to do with a situation with love so um, it's an upsetting situation that has been happening in your life in your relationship with some people not not all and whatever is going to happen you're going to successfully um, come out of this okay you're going to be successful coming out of this on the other hand what is happening is that whoever this person was uh, is going the energy vibration is going to change because whoever that it's, this could be you realizing that what you have done was vitally not good and you were you know a snitch of that sort of a thing and you know you you areas have a, have a way of doing that sort of a thing and thinking that you're trying to do something that is good because you don't believe certain things and so but you do it from an ego base because you always um, you're never happy that somebody has much more than you so be aware of what you give out you're going to receive it back in this week okay be aware of that always I said to people always be positive always be positive because um, the time and the energies on this planet is changing and whatever we do to other people that is exactly what we receive so when people start crying and you know I've always done good for other people and they never do good for me 
you can do good but the thoughts that behind it if you're doing good because you want someone to like you or something uh, or you want something from that person then you're not going doing it from a, a good place okay in the weekend we have the energy of the magician so Saturday will be one of your only best days Saturday Wednesday in the middle of the week it's a lot of confusion a lot of emotional turmoil Saturday we have the energy of awareness and this energy of awareness is a positive one because it's really awakening you with this energy of awareness it's all about your money it's all about your money it's all about your financial stability it's about where you are where you want to be where you're going what is happening and what you want to do so be aware of whatever is going on around you because you're going to realize that whatever you do on Saturday and whatever you manifest with your thoughts that is what is going to come in your reality so be aware of that on Saturday as we look forward and Sunday whatever your financial situation was is it's going to change some it's going to change for the better in whatever sense it is it's going to change for the better good things are about to come in your life whoever and you know you people have been working on this energy vibration because now it's in reverse and it's twice that it comes up in reverse and I'm looking at these energies because more informations are coming in and whatever that you people were doing and if there was a situation where there was a child who has been doing something to a parent stop it okay if you were a child who has been taking money from your parents stop it okay it's not good whatever you were doing to your parents be aware of this this is not good people okay adjust your energy balance of what you were doing and realize that if you come up stealing from your parents people will steal from you your whole kids will steal from you so be aware of what is happening this coming week for you Aquarians it's, 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 it's going to be a week eh? it's going to be a week of turmoil not only for you Aquarians but also for the, the, the air people it's going to be a week where a lot of situations some people are going to feel defeat some people are going to feel beaten down but whatever happened remember that sometimes you try to do something you know life is full of a lot of positive positive situation okay L listen life is full of a lot of positive but it's also it's a it's a time of play um, play this and what what the angels and guides want you to do is to learn to connect with them and by learning to connect with your angels and guides you are going to realize that so many stuff is going to come out and this week it's not a week of love you have Monday is a good um, thing because you're connecting with the universe and then you had on Wednesday whatever the conflict is whatever that you know because obviously some of you are not uh, it's like you want to breed it's like you're not seeing things clearly it's like so much things happening a lot of stuff happening you're not seeing things clearly and all of this is happening around you and you're not seeing things clearly and what you need to do is to clear your mind clear your mind in this time ask for protection clear your mind ask for protection whatever that has been happening with somebody who is the queen of cups uh, there is an energy that is going to break that down so if you had a situation with someone who was a cancer a pisces or a scorpion whatever the situation is is as if it's going to be broken down now whatever that holds you that bond you with that person it's going to be broken down and that's going to be on thursday for some people this woman could be coming in as a nurtured figure but what I'm seeing is that the tower and then her, that means that whatsoever between you and her, there is going to be a collapse of this. On Friday, it's going to be good. Friday is going to be good because it's the energy of love. Whatever, if you are, 
you know looking forward to connect with other people Friday is going to be good because it's going to be a huge victory something victorious something you're moving away from something you're going to end the relationship some people are going to end the relationship um, some people are going to receive news that is going to let them think I am not going any further with this relationship I'm going to end this relationship what is happening is that it's going to be ended for some and some people are going to be moving on to new relationships so some people will be ending and some people will be beginning new relationships so this is extremely positive in the sense that it depends on what you're looking for in this week because everything that you're looking for is actually here but it's going to be an emotional week you have a situation movements choices and decision most of you women are going to be having on Tuesdays movement choices and decision that you have to make and this is going to be extremely positive whatever the the church because there's movement in twice in the week you have movement on Tuesday movement on Friday so whatever it is with you women out there there is going to be a progression of movement this is a week where the week is going to affect all these women all the stuff that is going to happen remember again you need to heal your crown chakras ask the universal angels to sing over you ask um, your guides your spirit guides um, source creator to clear you because there's going to be a lot of emotional upset and this is because of the energy of the week because it's a zodiac energy of water and fire okay water and fire so water and fire is is a whole lot of emotion that is going to come up in this week and with the energy of uh, you know you're feeling as if you're lost and some people you know can't balance out certain things um, some people are not feeling the the difference between the the, the materialistic world um, the, the, the spiritual world the unseen world and who you are there is new energies coming in on this planet and it's not going to be one of uh, a positive week I did use the energies of these cards. You guys got the chakra, so you need to work on your seven chakra, which is the crown chakra. So whatever is happening in this week, you need to work on your crown chakra. Um, the energy that we're having also, it is from the Ascendance Master in this week. Whatever the situation is that is going on around you is from the Ascendance Masters. And you have Saint Germain, so call upon Saint Germain. I believe in my abilities to create miracles. I believe in my abilities to create miracles. I believe in my abilities to create miracles. So whatever is happening, uh, you need to believe in yourself and understand that as you believe in yourself, you know that you can make, uh, you can create the life that you would like to have. Okay. And number um, three and uh, number eight is going to be a significant it's going to play a significant number two number two number three and number eight is going to play a significant point in this week for you so your zodiac number is two three and eight two three and eight so yet still it's not really a, such a bad week it's just a week of emotional balance and that is exactly what is going on so i want to wish each and every person each and every one of you a wonderful week I'm sorry there is just something very smelly so um, enjoy yourself and we will speak next week whatever you do remember that love is the only thing that is real and know there there are positive things that are about to come so this is going to be good so enjoy again there is positive movements positive movements forward positive movements forward no matter how this week is looking so i'm saying namaste until next week